What the frack is up, Rusty Gamers? I'm Rusty Man, and welcome back to our Dragon playthrough of Endless on the Endless Legends. <laughs> so, when we last left off, we had just scattered around the area, got into some fights, finished the quest to kill some roaming guys for a sword, which we got. So, actually, I don't think this guy will actually be of much use with it, though. But he did level up. So let's check it out. What does his skills include? One vision for fl on flying unit? Ooh, that's actually nice. Yeah, I can't wait to get to the flying units. I, I hope they're like really, really cool mechanically. Mm, let's see, what do we got? We got the ruin searches, um, one XP per turn, and great one defense on units. We got the keen observer, which gives him plus two reinforcement positions on unit and garrisons. He's got the uh, battle him. Plus one attack on units. Practice strike one initiative. Uh, plus four life on units. And then his last is armor ergonomics. One, one, plus one extra accessory slot on hero. That's pretty cool. Let's see, what's his ending? Cold operator. No negative effects from winter. Winter food reduction immunity on Cine. Winter dust reduction immunity on Cine. And winter in just, uh, yeah, for <laughs> sure. Winter industry reduction immunity on city. All right, that's pretty cool. What about the faction wise? He gets plus 10 uh, appreciation, cultural and improvement. Basically, your happiness on city. Um, let's see what effect. Plus 10% life on units. Okay. Friendly banner, plus one truce from roaming army on. What? What does that mean? That, I don't know what that actually means. That's interesting. I have to look that one up sometime. See, we got plus two influence on city center and district at level three. It's the same thing. Okay. Well, hmm. I think we're gonna grab this because that 10% life is freaking awesome. We're gonna grab that. All right. We're gonna go for that. Anyways, we got five turns till we're done with the uh, was it the burrow? Yeah, the burrow. Which we'll have. Where are we building the burrow at? Right here. So we'll unlock these three tiles. This style, this style, and this style right here. Beautiful. Beautiful, sir. Beautiful indeed. Right. Then we're probably gonna maybe build another unit, and then we'll just start doing some of our infrastructure. We'll probably change this eventually. Right now, I'm just looking at it. What if I go to three? That removes it down one, that's good. All right, I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna just take out the boss right Oh, they finally added it. Initiate negations with a minor faction. If you fulfill their demands, all of their villages will be in the region will be pacified peacefully. That's cool. Let's see if we can do this. Make sure there is no enemy in the region of Salamon for five turns. All right. Is there an enemy? I don't see an enemy. Are you an enemy? You look like a boss. You're a boss unit, right? Yeah. I think you are, right? You're part of the boss? I think you are. I'm not sure. All right. Well, there we go. It's end our turn. So, that's cool. I'm glad that's finally implemented because, like, pretty much before, the only thing you do is just attack them. So, that's cool that that's actually implemented now. Ugh, enemy units. I want to see if they attack me. If they attack me, they're an enemy. That's how I'm going to look at it. Uh, we got one of our Drakenlings up. We can actually use him to scout over here. See if there's any enemies. Is there any enemies afoot? Alright. I'm pretty sure that's a boss, though. I'm not 100% sure. But. Okay, well, we're just going to auto this one. Pretty simple. Boom. All right. So that must mean. Is there any more? Check. Doesn't look like it. All right. So we have imminent empire plan where we can improve something within our province, our cities. Currently plus seven per turn on dust. We are plus two on influence. Well, what the hell? All right, auto. Just auto that. I mean, apparently they're 
really obsessed. I thought I autoed it. Okay. Whatever. We don't need to auto. Why'd you go way here back here, son? Get up here. Get up in this fight. Will you scurr? Let's do it. Alright. There we go. Ah, excuse me. Why am I here? Go on HP. Oh, because I just fought that one dude. That's right. Yeah. He's gonna get right in there, which is fine. Oh, he has a cleave attack. Wow, isn't that just nuts? Boom. This is kind of why I wanted to auto this. This is just like. Pretty straightforward fight. I'm pretty sure we're not gonna lose it in any way, shape, or form. This keeps happening. We come on. And boom, you're down. And boom, no. Alright. Alright. So let's send you let's send you over here, I guess. I'm gonna send you over here. And in one turn, that will be done. Beautiful. End the turn. There we go. Boom. Our Burrow Street is done. We now have uh, two more soak. Completed sea stories as well. Now we are working on the mill foundry. Provides us plus six industry and plus 50% industry on city. Wow. Awesome. And the uh, sea stores provides plus 10 on city during some summer, summer season. And then plus 15% on city. And negative one dust on city upkeep. So all in all, it's a great freaking thing to have. All right, so in six turns, a dragon lane will be produced. We'll actually keep that. I think. Sounds good to me. All right, and then we're definitely going to do C. So we're actually going to remove the public library and the sewer system. Actually, we're going to remove all. Oop. Well, looks like we're doing that first. <laughs> I accidentally canceled the dragon lane. No point in worrying about it now. And then we'll grab the dust dredgers. I like getting the food and dust up. Although I am doing a scientific run. That's right. I am totally doing a scientific run. We definitely want to grab the uh, public library. So, you know, we'll grab the public library and then we'll do a dragon link. Then we'll do the dust stuff. And then we'll do geomic lab. That's only a small increase. Like, what does it actually give me? Yeah, it's going to be a plus two of science on terrain. Plus science. The base, I mean, like, that's good, but I'd rather have the uh, public library and sea storage first. We can worry about the rest later, right? Sounds good to me. If it doesn't sound like you, shut up. I can't. I can't. But now, this game is definitely, you know, uh, oh, you got a quest completed. Rough men. Congratulations, the village in the region of Salamar. Trust your protection. They're pacified and willing to serve you. We earned the Valiant Lightning Pacification, which is a crossbow. And that looks pretty cool. Ah, oh, so now what? I mean, we can actually... No, we can't. Basically, they're a part of us. They give us some of their resources, which is the effects. And to actually use them, we have to assimilate them. Which does give us their centaur, which I'm not wanting really. I don't really care about that. I want to know if we can go talk to them if we're not in our province. I just want to see if this will work. If not, we're going to have to create a settler, which we'll probably end up actually doing after the drag coming. That sounds smart. Alright, so we got that. Boom. Right. Yeah, I don't want to assimilate them, but I do like having them being obedient. As long as they fight for me. Which they don't actually. I don't think they do anything after this. Basically, they, this is just considered like a, a little part of your province. You gain the bonus of their city or their little village here. That's about it. I don't think they actually move around. That'd be cool if they did. I kind of wish they did. They had like a little AI of their own when they would just wander around protecting the, like, the little con. That'd be cool. And they allow you to recruit their units, something like that. That'd be sweet. Let's see if we can parlay with them. If we can't, we're not going to do anything. I just want to see if we can. Sea storage is done now. Boom. And now we're working on the public library. It's 
awesome. And the Empire plan is here. So what shall we do? Basically, I can literally do this if I wanted to right now. We actually might. I don't know. Um, although we could do that. 25 isn't building buyout. But actually, I don't want building buyout. I think I'm going to go with this. 33% building cost reduction. Although, having the happiness, but we got already got 20%. We'll take this. We'll do this. This is what we're going to do. I like it. Oops, I meant to... Oops. Parlay. Can we parlay with you, my lady? My ladies. Parlay. Colonize the region of Indigo. Okay, well, that's straightforward. I like it. You know what? We're actually might buy it. How much does it cost? 604? No, we're not buying it. <laughs> That's too rich for my blood. I'm a cheap bastard. Oh, wait. Ah, uh, it's a glass steel. I thought it was a ruin. I could search it. Like, Did they search that? Alright, so we're going to conquer that. We'll take in the uh, beautifulness that is of the Sisters of Mercy. They shall be mine. Alright, so we got six turns on our settler. That's beautiful. Probably just gonna scout out just a little more, see what else we got out here. Alright, let's go out here. Oop, I just heard something over here. What's going on? Oh, you can actually hear what's going on over here. Interesting. Sounds like they created a burrow. What are you doing here? Yellow. Who's yellow? Oh, okay. I don't see yellow. There is no yellow. What are you doing out here, buddy? Hmm? We're just gonna auto this one. Get a fight. Boom! Schmitz. We took care of the sisters of mercy. Do not worry. We will protect you. Alright, so it's under turn. Beautiful. Beautiful indeed, says. Alright. This code is actually what? Two here? Mill Foundry is now done. We are now working on the search party, which will increase our search on ruins. What is that? That's cool. What is that? Die deposit? Plus 50% influence on city, plus 5% uh, happiness on city. That's pretty good. I don't actually don't know what that is. Is that actually called happiness? I kind of feel like an idiot if it's not called happiness, but I mean, it has the same effect as like happiness from like, you know, civilization and stuff. So, same time, meh. One vision of flying unit. You know, we'll grab that. That sounds cool. I think our flying unit's gonna be coming up soon once we get to tier two. Yeah, all right, so four turns away. Oh, yeah, let's go search. We're gonna see. Uh, I wonder if they. Yeah, you can actually see the burrow coming out, can't you? Or is that just how their cities look? I don't remember. I don't even have a roving plans play there going on. Oh, how great is that? Move over here. We're gonna scout up to their border. I wanna see what they're doing. You know, make sure everything's a okay. Not, you know, not finding like an army just flashing across my freaking screen. Something like that, which wouldn't surprise me. I see you, Jodas. You stay away. All right, one turn for settler. Speaking of civilization, which is pretty much why I'm saying happiness, I cannot wait for Beyond Earth, man. I already got that pre-ordered. I, I am good to go when that comes. Oh, no, I meant that. Go on me. Go, quickly. Hold the turn ends. We'll grab that real quick. There we go. One turn for Dust Judger. Wow, nice. First party and our research crew is empty, so we're going to grab that for sure, just so we have that on on the, uh, the down low, I guess. Do we have anything else to improve science? Oh, science. Oh, I already got all those, that's right. Okay, so what we're gonna wanna grab is that. What does that put us at? Oh, we actually only need one more research to unlock that, that's cool. 
Now, we're gonna grab a titanium extractor. We're gonna grab advanced armor. Actually, we're just gonna complete this entire tier right here. We're just gonna do that. It'll go quick, especially with our uh, with science coming up, as quickly as it is. All right, now we just gotta find a place to settle in here. Actually, doing it right near them actually isn't a bad idea. We got four industry here. I'm just looking for big food tiles. I don't see any crazy food tiles. I see a lot of twos right in this area. I might do it right next to them. We got four science over here though. Mm. Now we can burrow to that. Where we're gonna go? Where is it? Right here. That way we take advantage of all these food tiles, and the city will prosper. It doesn't have a lot of industry though. I mean, I guess I have four industry in the two, but it doesn't have a lot after that. So that'll be fine though. We will be a-okay with that, and our dust dredger is about to be done. And two turns for the mill foundry, I believe is what that is. We'll just do this right here. Yeah, why not? We'll do that right there. Boom. Maintain a minimum of free influence in your city of Indigo during five turns. All right. Basically, what that means is we want to go over here. I don't think we'll be able to do that as easily as uh, it sounds. If anything that provides influence. Doesn't look like it, so we'll grab seed storage. And I guess we'll grab um the sewer system. The sewer system will cancel that. Grab the sewer system and then the seed storage. Alright. Let's see. Oh, I forgot all about this guy over here. You having fun over here, dude? Chilling? Spying on the enemy. We gained 50 science. Full science. All right, guys, and with that, I am going to call this video right here. As you can see, we have just, well, obviously you've seen if you watch this video all the way through. Not, why did you skip to this exact point in time? That's interesting, very nice. Good for you for landing right on that. Anyways, the, we just took Indiger, which is great, and now we are working on bringing the Sisters of Mercy into a civilization. And with that, I think we are the first to expand. I mean, I don't really know. Maybe not. I don't know. These two are pretty close to each other. Looks like his border's right here, so I think he's expanded. Mm, yeah, this is going to get interesting. I wonder how many wars will be going on. I wonder if they're at war right now. That would be something interesting to find out. But anyways, guys, thanks for watching, Rusty Gamers. And I'll see you in the next episode of our Rovi or Rovi Clan. Our dragon playthrough. Take it easy.